All right guys, welcome to the video. Today I'm gonna to be practicing crooked grinds. I've got two goals for this video. One is to crook the entire ledge, and two is just to crook and pop out and actually like have speed. A lot of times I pop out and it's just like, my crooks are dead. So in this video, I'm gonna be talking about like what's going through my head when I'm trying to get my crooks going, how I get into it, how I pop out of it, and how I hold it. I'm not like a professional, but this is just my process. So let's get some crooks. All right, let's start things off with just a back 50. Get used to this ledge. Black arm kick flip, can he? All right, do back 5-0. Oh, <laughs> fell out of it. Faggy flip. There we go. You good, buddy? Stuck on that one pretty bad. Try and get another one about the same speed. So the issue there is not getting the weight transferred onto my right foot fast enough and keeping the weight, the head inside the ledge. So this time I'll make those two adjustments, head inside, transfer the weight faster. It'll be Gucci. There it is. One thing that helps a lot is this hand position behind my thigh right here. Helps me get my shoulders in the right place. Okay, so I've done a few going like my normal speed. As you can see, I don't land with much rollout speed at all. So now I'm gonna try and speed it up a bit. Gosh dang. My legs are a little bit tired because I was skating before this, so I'm having a hard time getting into it. Oh my gosh. There's that a little bit more speed on this guy. Hopefully that looked all right. Oh, that was garbage. Bit more speed. It's honestly a lot more tiring than I thought. My legs are kind of like getting shaky. Fakey heel flip. No. Even faster. Dude, when you stand on top of the ledge like that, when you bail, you know you're all sorts of too close, too far over the ledge. You need to give yourself more space. I don't know why I'm doing this, because I know that is not the way to do crooks. Sometimes I just like, mentally I'm rolling up to it and I feel like everything's fine. And then when I bail, I'm like, well, that's why. Oh boy. You see me get into like the middle of my truck and then slips into the lock. Again, I'm just like, feel like being close is a good thing, it's not. Same thing again. A little bit faster. A little bit. Ah, that was all right. Fakey heel flip. Oh my God. Worst trick ever. And even a little bit more speed now. Keep your distance. Or just right it right next up. Yep, this one. Ooh. I felt that, right here. Ooh. I'm feeling it a little bit more. The speed makes it tough, but right here, we got it. Oh. There we go. Man, it was pretty good speed that time. Now the fakie heel. <laughs> At least I fell on my butt and on my hip. I'm gonna go slow, but I'm gonna get in at the beginning. It like is a completely different picture in my head when I get at the beginning. So I'm gonna do some get in at the beginning, probably pop out in the middle, and then eventually try and add some speed 
from the beginning, do the whole thing. Go pretty slow to start. Yeah, I'm like tripping out because it looks different. Just gotta keep the space. At least I like got my truck on the ledge. <laughs> I was like doing all these things with my arms. Took me in a nose slide. You gotta really like sit with your arm and shoulders like open. So that way when you get in, this arm goes forward. So you're sitting with your shoulders parallel. Let's get that weight transfer. need to get into a few like that pop out get a little bit more comfortable add some speed and then I think we'll make it to the end of the ledge <laughs> that was scary dude oh accidentally almost took that one to the house Every time I end up on top of the ledge and my head is over my right foot and I'm like, you know, that doesn't work. Well, I'm getting in. I feel like if I just go a bit faster, I might get lucky. Oh my gosh. Can't even set up my feet right. Dude. That time, my head somewhat inside, then I just didn't transfer the weight. Cool. Here's the thing. I would have landed that. I would have popped out of that. Except for I'm not keeping my head far enough in. Just doing the bare minimum. Dude. I feel like my brain is there, but my legs are not. I mean, to be fair, I am skating with a hip injury, and so maybe my left leg just doesn't have the strength to pop. Like, I'm not getting enough spring off my back foot to get onto my front foot, but really, I could just fix that by lifting my front foot out of the way faster. I was gonna wax this ledge, but right now, I'm not even getting in, like, consistent enough to even bother with that, so. Maybe if I start like holding some, I'll start waxing it. Oh. You know? Does that count? I tried so hard to hold it and pop out, but the goal is to get across this line. That one, I landed on the line. So, let's see. Oh my gosh. You see how far I am on top of the ledge? Okay, that felt so much better. Kept my head inside, even though I slipped a back nose. Felt a million times better. Shoulders got turning. At least I'm finally getting into it. Oh, man, if I was over that, I just was too far back, but I was primed to get off the end. Oh, getting in there. That was weird. Oh, that was so bad. Oh. I was so close, I just popped out like a goober. Oh my God. Felt so good and then felt like death. Oh. I do not know how I'm not dead. What's up, Joe? How are those dunks treating you, dude? Pretty good. Pretty good. I know. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! Holy! Oh. Oh. 
Dude, I have this hipper. And you just hit it? Yeah, I just hit it. I guess it's dusty right here because I just like put my foot down. Dude. Oh my gosh, I like straight Charlie Brown. Yeah, right on that last hit. I think I might be done. Of all the falls to end the session, oh my gosh. All right, well, as you can see, you never know what you're gonna get. I feel happy. I got to the, led, the end of the ledge a couple times. I don't know, close enough. I really took a big hit on my hip. So we're gonna call it there, but hope you guys enjoyed this video. Remember to make every single day a Friday. Grab some Friday gear underneath this video or the link will be in the description and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.